Welcome to the NC Spin After Spin. Additional comments from our panelists just available on our website. Cash Michaels, I want to ask you, what do you wish you had said on last week's show, but you didn't? Two things. Number one, uh, former Governor McCrory, get over yourself. And uh, number two, it amazes me that when we talk about ALEC, we do not talk about the, uh, the corporate influence there and the fact that um, a lot of the uh, cookie-cutter legislation that we've seen across the country uh, being introduced by, by Republicans, Republicans in particular uh, came from these posh junkets that uh, ALEC uh, and corporations had, have uh, uh, sponsored and where they have these task force task forces and, and then they, they come up with these bills and they, they, they sign off on them and then folks run back to their respective legislatures and then have them uh, uh, passed. That's how we got Stand Your Ground. Um, that's how we've gotten a lot of the voter ID stuff that, that, that's been across the country. And, and I think that needs to be recognized and people need to realize that, um, uh, you know, when you have lawmakers, I forget what state it was, who are printing up bills and they forget to take the ALEC um, uh, logo off, off the, uh, the document, that tells you something, you know, and, and we need to pay close attention to that kind of foolishness. I'm taking it you're not a big supporter of Alley. Have I ever lied to you? <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for watching the After Spend. We'll have more video all during the week on ncspend.com.